Okay, I just want to make sure Donovan doesn't accidentally pop into frame at any point. So all I'm doing here is I am gonna <sighs> be right back. Okay, need to get these. I went through my closet. I'm grabbing some more clothes that I think could benefit from being cropped or cut or just experimented on in general. You're gonna hear noises in the background. It's because my little boy is playing and he's three. So you're gonna hear noises. Okay, so I have this shirt here. It's one of these, you know, that cut, that's pretty see-through as you can see. That's another problem with it. It's, it's a little more sheer than I expected and it's got this going on. Like it's wider and it's got the high-low business going on. It's not a bad shirt. But on me, it does not work. It doesn't work at all. A little too sheer, it's not the right shape. Where it starts going out is where my body is kind of still in and then it goes out, so it just doesn't work. I'm going to cut it, uh, crop it. So that way I can wear a tank. But instead of cutting it underneath, uh, to cover underneath my chest, I'm actually gonna go above, so I'm gonna make I'm gonna try to make it go like around here so it just kind of does a little curve this way. I think that'll look better for this specific shirt. Yay! Um, so I think that's what I'm gonna do with this because I also don't want this gray color just here. I actually really like wearing this shirt underneath t-shirts because of these sleeves. I think it's just an extra added when it's a little cooler so I'm wearing a t-shirt but I have something underneath it type of thing. So even if I cut it and I'm not a huge fan, or if I am a huge fan, either way I could still wear it underneath t-shirts. It's still gonna serve as the sleeves. I'm going to fold this. So I probably should be showing you exactly what I'm doing. So now I'm gonna try it on right over this tank. That is the reason I'm wearing a tank. Okay, so this, this is what it could, I guess if I did it a little bit higher, it would have like a little peak like this. Um, and then maybe it would look a little bit otherwise. There's this piece, this piece of nothing left over. That, yeah. Now I really am scrappy, all this, this cow neck. I mean, I could probably attempt to make this actually work, but I don't know that I'm going to do that. I'm just playing around. This other shirt is pretty much shaped the same way, except it's all black. So because it's all black, that's that's like halfway down. Okay, I'm being very precise. It's like halfway down. This one is interesting because it's got like extra material just so it can puff out on the sides. There's just an extra, so you can see this extra strip on both sides, just so it can widen out like that like the other one was cut that way this one it was cut straight and those were just added on out because these look a little funny like that all right two down donovan is listening to colors in french i keep hearing rouge orange and i'm like <sighs> all right i mean honestly the way he's going he, he might just one day decide hey, i know how to speak french Again, cloth for a mask or something else, but you know. This, this I just brought down because I was like, I, I'm not going to wear a skirt. This I bought this a long time ago and never wore it because it's a mini skirt and I'm just not really a mini skirt person. Like I used to, I mix it up. Like one day I'll dress like 
the baggiest clothes ever. And then the next day, maybe I'll wear a tight dress because I felt like it. Or a flowy one or just something, you know? Oh, I just scratched myself. I figure instead of that, just wear this as a shirt. Um, I don't know if that's going to work, but like maybe with a something over it. Over this, please. I would say with this over it, but I'm sure it's been on online and in different ways. I don't know about the specific type of pant. I've got some palazzos. The thing is, I bought these because they were, I feel like they were the only ones of this kind when I found it, and they're medium. Now, now this fits my waist, finally. The problem is it fits my weight, my natural waist, which is a little higher and these pants want it to be. So we got this going, trying to go a little too high. We don't need that. We don't like that. Tight. So my idea for these, because I love the pattern and the colors on them. A shirt. Now I figured what I could do is cut a neckline somehow here and then that that's literally it because then you have mm -hmm. sleeves instant shirt now I don't know if it's gonna look good on me I don't want to screw those pants up so I have a second pair of palazzos that I'm going to tr use as my first trial run my body has just changed since having a child these fit my waist they just don't fit them in the place that these pants want them to fit. So they just don't feel right. They're, they've, it's not right. Miss Palazzo's. Come on. Fold these in half. That's right. No, that wasn't so bad. I have a little head. <laughs> Doesn't really take a big cut. Oh my goodness, you have to see the drama. Look at this. Look, look at this. Oh my goodness, this. And you don't like your palazzos. Then. I don't know what style this makes me think of. It's like it's 70s maybe? I don't know. <laughs> this one will probably be a little bit tighter too because it was a little a little bit smaller than that. So. Maybe I'll do another, I'll do a catwalk. Another one. I didn't hate that either. <laughs> like corset style situation going on in front. And I love it. The problem is, again, on my shape, it doesn't quite work. The corset wants to start too high. Do is cut a big neckline out of this so it goes like so it's like an underbust corset because then I can wear whatever shirt I want uh, to cover this whole thing. Here's the neckline, right? Since I want this lower and I don't want to touch this, so I don't want to touch the sides here, I'm going to just pull this out. What shape I want to go for here? I don't want a V.
hurts. It just, the thing is, if this happens, and uh, I could probably use this, I probably use this more for, for Halloween or something. So, there's that. Okay, so that worked out. I should just possibly stop while I'm ahead. I'm just gonna show what the hoodie looks like that I did off camera. So that's it for my uh, clothes cutting escapades for today. And if you have some clothes that you just don't wear, you know, you can consider doing something like this. I just don't feel like you have to, obviously. You can always give them to somebody or donate them, or, you know, if you know how to sew, you could change them up a little bit. I don't want to ramble, so I think I should end this here and stop saying so every five seconds and anyway and um. Have a nice day. I hope life gives you what you need.